came to church. I mean, uh, the fight, the church. How many of you guys are here? We're just glad you're here. Uh, you know, we do this, uh, Manny, uh, y'all need to know this. But Manny's not always been a Christian. And uh, he was a wild, wild person. And his life was in shambles. Uh, he had fame, but his life was in, sh in, 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 sh in, in shambles. And then he found the Lord. And now, everywhere he goes, it doesn't matter where he goes, he does what he's doing right now. He gets people together, he worships, and he wants the Bible to be taught. We've done that in China, at the fight at Macau. We've done that in Las Vegas. The same thing happened in Las Vegas. Last three or four fights. People come to watch the fight. They hear about the chapel. They come to the chapel. They hear the worship. They hear the message and they get saved. Can, yeah, you, can you imagine that? And, 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 and uh, there's a line that says what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. But I want you to know that what happens in Vegas stays with you for the rest of your life. And we always talk about Manny when they, they come to Las Vegas to the fight, but they hear about the chapel. They come to the chapel and they get saved. When they go back home and their friends say, hey, what'd you do this weekend? They go, I went to Vegas. Well, what did you do at Vegas? And they go, I got saved. Can you imagine people with a testimony, I got saved in Vegas? And uh, that same thing is said here in Australia. And uh, Manny, I want to thank you and Jinky for allowing us all to be here and to have chapel. So let's thank them if we can do that. And then uh, uh, Skip is here, who is the pastor of a church here in uh, Brisbane called Worship Center in Karina. Skip, I want you to stand for just a second. This is where Manny went to church this last Sunday. Oh, Skip! Yeah, Manny goes to church every Sunday. It doesn't matter where he is, he goes to church. And this Sunday, he went to Skip's church. And uh, Skip, you're a wonderful preacher. You did a wonderful job uh, preaching on Sunday. And if you're in this room and you don't have a church and you live here, because Manny's going back to the Philippines, I'm going back to Los Angeles. But if you live here and you're looking for a church, you need to go visit the Worship Center Church in Karina and hear this brother preach. He's an excellent preacher. So, last night, how many of you were here last night? Raise your hand. How many of you were not here last night? Raise your hand if you were not here. Oh, no, look, most of the crowd. All right, let's put the first slide up here. Last night, uh, we started a series. It's four, it's four parts. Last night was part one. Tonight's part two. Tomorrow night will be part three. Saturday night will be part four. It's called Three Days That Changed the Entire World. And we're looking at the three days that Jesus died, and that he was buried, and that he rose from the grave. If we go to the next slide, I want to show you the four, the four uh, messages, the four Bible study. And that's why we're here. I know some of you don't understand this, but we're not here to take a picture of Manny and Jinky. We're here to study the Bible. Yeah. 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 